What's going on guys? Welcome to your next tutorial and what we're going to do in today's tutorial is add a sub menu to our first menu. It's pretty much the same concept as what we've done before. Um, instead of adding a menu to our menu bar, we're just going to add another menu to a menu. So the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to create a J menu called sub uh, for sub menu. Again, this is just going to be a new J menu. And we're just going to call this, you know, a uh, sub menu something uh, very creative. Um, so the next thing that we have to do to a sub menu is add some menu items again. So we're just gonna say J menu item. Um, we're gonna call this test is equal to new um, J menu item. And we're gonna say test. So now that we have that done, we need to add the test to our sub menu. Again, we just do that by referring to the menu, say add, and then our item, which was called test. So the last thing that we have to do is add our submenu to our actual menu um, or whatever menu we want to add it to. So we could either add it to first or second. Um, I'm just going to refer to the first menu that we created, even though our second one doesn't have anything in it yet, so that's fine. But we're just going to say add and then the menu, so our submenu, and we're just going to save and run it. Let's check this out, see what happens. As you guys guess, some magic happens. We have a submenu item within our first menu. And within our sub menu, we have you know some options called test. We can select that as well. Um, so that's kind of the basic framework of a menu. So I think I'm probably going to be done with all this menu stuff, and we're just going to cover some basic uh, concepts again before we get into uh, the next series of Java, where we're going to get into game development. Um, so again, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll catch you later. Have a good one.